Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, ituturo ko sa inyo kung paano na-verified ang aking Google AdSense account kahit wala pa akong PIN gamit lamang ang government-issued ID. So, let's start! So, start natin. Mag-login tayo sa ating Google AdSense account. So, eto na yung home. Nakapag-login na ako. So, scroll down natin siya. Dito sa verify your billing address, i-click natin yung 3 dots sa taas and then click help. So dito, address verification overview, i scroll natin siya pababa. Hanapin natin yung pin troubleshooter. So eto pin troubleshooter, i-click natin 'yan. And then May mga tanong dito na ating sasagutin. Personal identification number pin or PIN. Are you earning greater than the verification threshold? So, kung may 10 dollars ka na sa inyong Google AdSense account, pwede ka nang mag-request ng PIN. So, i-click natin yung yes. Kasi may 10 dollars na doon. And then next is have you received your PIN? So, ako wala pa akong nare-receive. So, click natin yung no. Tapos, meron dito yung isang question ulit. Have you already requested four replacement pins? So, ako naka four. Request na ako ng pins. So, i-click natin yung yes. So, nakalagay dito, you'll have four months from the date on which your first pin was generated to enter it in your account if you haven't entered it for four months then we'll stop showing ads on your page please contact us to verify your account so click natin yung contact us para ma-verify yung account natin so dito ilalagay natin yung name kasi required siya And then, yung contact email address, automatic na yan, nakalagay. Then, your AdSense Publisher ID, open lang natin yung account natin. And then, i-copy natin yung Publisher ID doon. Tapos, i-paste natin. So, ayan. And then, submit an attachment. So, i-click natin ang choose files para kunin yung mga IDs natin for verification. So, dito, dalawa ang ilalagay ko kasi yung passport ko is na, iba yung address. Kaya, gagamit ako ng statement of account na galing Sun Life. Kasi, yun yung uh, supporting documents ko na yung address ko sa AdSense is the same yung address ko doon sa ibibigay kong supporting documents. And then, tapos na. So, i-click natin yung submit. So, ito na yung notification, guys. The form has been submitted to AdSense support. We'll try to get back to you within 24 hours. If your query is about your own account and requires an action from our size. So, ito na yun, guys. So, tapos na siya. So, hintay-hintay na lang natin yung respond nila kung mabe-verify na or kailangan pa ng ibang supporting documents kasi magkaiba nga yung address ng passport ko doon sa billing address na sinabmit ko doon sa Google AdSense account ko. And guys, tapos na nating nag-submit ng mga documents and then on uh, after seconds lang hindi pa siya umabot ng 1 minute may, may email na sa akin agad si 
Google AdSense. So, ito yung email niya sa akin. Sabi niya, thanks for sending your proof of identity. We're happy to let you know that this fulfills the address verification requirements for AdSense. So, ibig sabihin, verified na ako. So, puntahan naman natin yung uh, ho, uh, yung Google AdSense natin. So, dito sa Google AdSense natin, wala na din yung notification dyan sa taas na kulay red na kailangan kong mag-log in tapos i-scroll down natin wala na din yung verify na nakalagay dito so ganito na yung dashboard so ayun guys so ito yung balance ko 335.30 yan yung sasahurin ko sa 21.30 So, ganun lang ang mag-verify ng Google AdSense account kahit wala pang dumating na PIN. So, ang dali, ba? Diba? Sana nakatulong ang video na ito sa inyo. At kung oo, please don't forget to click, subscribe, like, and click the notification bell para maging updated kayo sa susunod ko pang mga tutorial. God bless everyone and keep safe always. Bye!